last week, Dr. Rajan, we also saw the government uh, announce certain important decisions with respect to foreign direct investment caps, removal of caps, enhancement of those caps in certain sectors and so on. But in the same week, you saw the exit of companies like Berkshire Hathaway, POSCO, ArcelorMittal. While I take your point that the intent of the government seems to be absolutely bang on, somewhere there seems to be a huge gap between intent and execution. What would be your advice, your prescription to the government uh, to get it right? Look, um, let, let's be careful about these big decisions. And, uh, you know, if you take ArcelorMittal and POSCO, remember POSCO still has a large plant it's building out in Orissa. So it may be a decision about do I do A or B? I don't need A and B. Mm. Uh, and look at the steel industry as a whole. It is suffering from some degree of overcapacity, especially as China uh, is, is slowing. And so uh, those could be business decisions. Of course, uh, any, anybody who comes into India uh, comes in with a sense that, uh, you know, some factors take a little longer. But also people who have stayed in uh, have made a lot of money. One example is Hindustan Labor, which is now uh, buying back its shares from the Indian market because it wants, in a sense, uh, to own more of its operations in India, how, given how successful they have been here. So let's uh, let's uh, not look only at the uh, at the uh, the bad side. There is all there are also good signs. Uh, but if you the point is that we need to uh, make it easier to come in. Mm. Uh, absolutely, and partly that was the intent behind uh, increasing the FDI caps, mm. but also making more uh, of uh, these caps automatic uh, rather than requiring permissions here and there. Uh, over time, I think we will do more in terms of liberalizing FDI. Uh, over time, uh, we will make it uh, easier. But let me emphasize those who've come in and, uh, you know, incurred the costs of, uh, of, uh, of coming in uh, have actually made a lot of profit, uh, something which can't be said of every country.